Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to do figure drawing at home. Uh, to me, one of the biggest things that's helped me become a better artist is figure drawing. And it's not always easy to find a class, uh, so this is the best alternative I've found. Uh, basically, it's a YouTube channel called um, On Air Video, and they, they do figure drawing classes uh, as their channel. I mean, they basically set up a camera, they have a model come in, and yes, she is nude or he is nude, but you can basically treat it like a regular figure drawing class, and I think for a lot of artists, it, it would help a ton to get this kind of experience. So right now, I'm gonna show you guys kind of how I have my uh, setup going to where I can just sit down, uh, push the play button on the video, and start drawing. So this is my normal setup right here, where I have my computer for graphics and my Cintiq for drawing digitally, and then my drawing desk right here with the lamp up there. Um, and then if you come over here, I have a couch set up, and a TV, and this is kind of our upstairs uh, den area for playing and video games and stuff like that. So, but the couch is really close, so the models will be really big. When the video starts, uh, basically they give a short little intro where they uh, ask for donations, and then the model comes out and they, she begins posing. And the first poses are generally four to five one minute poses. If you've never taken figure drawing before, this can be kind of rough on people who have never experienced like drawings like drawing like this. You have to draw very quickly. It's more about um, getting an idea of the gesture uh, of the figure um, rather than creating beautiful drawings. This is just to get kind of warm you up and help you see the figure. So this video is actually my first uh, attempt at doing this, where I draw from the YouTube channel, and I really liked it. I'm going to do it a lot more, uh, because figure drawing helps so much with all other aspects of drawing, uh, especially these warm-up drawings. I feel like if I just had the discipline to do these more often, to really um, practice drawing and warm up like these kind of drawings encourage you to do, a lot of my drawings would turn a lot better. So as you can see from these first set of drawings, uh, these are really simple gesture drawings just trying to get the pose down. Uh, now the video switches to two minute poses so you have a little bit more time but still you're just trying to um, rough out the figure and maybe add, see the value uh, of the figure a little bit here. So with the two minute poses you want to kind of see how the light models the body. Uh, this is where you're looking at kind of values, um, where your highlights are, stuff like that. Um, like I said, this is the first time I've ever uh, kind of done this figure drawing from the video. Um, and so I was, I was pretty slow, actually. I have the video sped up, if you couldn't tell. I'm not really that twitchy. But um, it's, I, I, could, I feel like I could have gotten more information down. Because that's what you're trying to do. You're trying to get, gather information in these first few poses. So one disadvantage of doing this like, uh, doing figure drawing like this is when you're in a figure drawing class, you can kind of choose uh, the angles and where you're sitting in relationship to the model. So you can really work on uh, composition and stuff when you want to, uh, when you're going for those 30 minute poses and stuff like that. With this, you're basically stuck with the same point of view over and over again. So this definitely doesn't replace figure drawing. Uh, it's just, you know, if you can't find a class, this is a great alternative. So, what I've gathered kind of from this is, uh, in doing it for my first time, is the way they do the videos, I think they have a new one out every week, but um, if you're disciplined enough to practice and do this once a week, like every time their video comes out, just sit down, I think the videos are a half hour long, and just get some um, cheap paper. I wouldn't use the paper I'm using right here. This was kind of a waste of paper, but I didn't have any newsprint <laughs> on me right now, so I just use some nicer paper, but um, is practice. Do these videos, and I guarantee you, after a year, you're gonna be a lot better at figure drawing. You're gonna learn so much doing this, uh, just about the human body. So uh, the last pose they do is a five minute pose. Um, and that's, you know, you can spend a little bit more time looking at the light and modeling the figure. But I wanted to do a little bit longer drawing, so I have just paused it on the last pose. And uh, 
Uh, this drawing took me 30 minutes. So basically I actually just chose one of the previous poses that I really liked and uh, decided to draw that one. So I actually went back to one of the shorter poses and uh, paused it on that. Um, so yeah, I haven't been figure drawing in a while, so I, I was kind of surprised by this. I felt like it turned out pretty good. I, uh, I really liked the lighting on it. That's why I chose this particular pose. Um, it was a really strong light source, which that's what you should really look for when you're doing drawings of figures. If you're drawing from a picture or photograph or anything, they'll always turn out a lot better if you choose a picture that has really good lighting, really strong lighting. So since this is just a 30 minute drawing, I didn't want to get too crazy with some of the smaller features. Like I wasn't worried whether or not it looked like her, uh, the model. I just wanted to kind of get a sense of her and then like fingers and toes and stuff like that. I just kind of uh, flushed out a little bit. I just really wanted to focus on the lighting um, and how it modeled the curves of the body. Um, that's one thing I really want to start uh, focusing on with my other art is strong light sources that model the figure in a realistic way. I tend to use light that is uh, fake, I guess you'd say. I just always light things from one side in the same way. So now that I've finished this video, I realized how much uh, I missed figure drawing. I really, really enjoy figure drawing and I hope you guys like this video. And I hope you guys give this a try. Uh, like I said, figure drawing is one of those things that can really help you improve as an artist. So anyway, uh, remember the YouTube channel is On Air Video and definitely check them out. Well, that's the video. Uh, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.